Brandon Gray was a contracted worker through Cementation USA, a graduate of Mullen High School. He was well liked through the Silver Valley, a community now mourning his loss. I knew Brandon since he was yeah, yay yeah, high. Chuck Ritz is once again saying goodbye to a man he knew. Both Merrick and Gray were tremendously great family men. Larry Merrick died at the Lucky Friday mine earlier this year. Then this weekend, Brandon Gray passed away from a mining accident. Ritz used to coach Gray in football and baseball. A tremendously coachable kid, very, very uh, liked. Gray graduated from Mullen High School in 2003. He started his mining career around four years ago. A little under a year ago, he joined Cementation USA with a bright future ahead of him. In fact, he was a leader and he, he was progressing to a foreman because he was a great miner and, and actually a very safe miner. As well. He had on all the safety gear, including a harness and safety line, when working in the number four shaft project, doing some work for excavating a bin. Gray and his partner were standing on top of a pile of broken rock about 15 feet high. That was fine until the rock pile started to move. For some reason, he started sliding into the rock pile. Gray's partner made it out because he was standing further back and not as close to the side. Why the gravel pile moved is unknown. Now the safety line is being looked at. Well, he had a safety line on, and, and uh, whether it prevented him from falling down the side of the pile and being all right, or it tended to pull him more into the pile, is, is kind of an unusual situation, a very unusual situation. Despite these two fatal accidents, before 2011, there were no fatalities at Lucky Friday Mine for 25 years. Safety Chuck Ritz believes in as he comes to terms with his loss. And we miss both of them, and especially during his Thanksgiving. In North Idaho, Anusha Roy, KXLY4 HD News.